Today in this video we will learn to do subtraction with borrowing. There is a math test in Gaffy's school tomorrow. Gaffy was solving some questions and Zoe came over to play with her. Gaffy, would you like to play with me? No Zoe, tomorrow is my exam and I have some questions to solve. Will you help me? Yes Gaffy, I will. Children, here is Gaffy's first question. There are 17 pencils in a box. Pinky took 8 pencils. How many pencils are left in the box now? Children, will you help Gaffy and Zoe to solve this question? Very nice. Here we have to find the pencils left in the box. We will use subtraction to solve this question. First, we will do the subtraction of the numbers in the units place. But 7 is a number smaller than 8. What should I do next? Gaffy, we have to borrow a number from the tens place. That's 7 becomes 17. Now, 8 subtracted from 17 is 9. They will write 9 below the units place. Let us now subtract the numbers in tens place. Friends, there is nothing to subtract from the tens place because we borrowed one number from it and there was only one number in the tens place. So, the answer will be 9. There are 9 pencils left in the box. Oh wow Zoe, we solved the question. But now I have to solve one more question. Let's see what is the next question. There are 15 biscuits in a packet. A mouse ate 6 biscuits. How many biscuits are left in the packet? Children, in this question, we have to find the number of biscuits left. We will use subtraction to solve this question. To solve this question, we will first subtract the numbers written in the units place. Here, 5 is a number smaller than 6. So here we will solve this problem by borrowing a number from the number written in tens. By borrowing our number of 5 becomes 15. 6 subtracted from 15 is 9. Write the answer below the units place. 15 minus 6 is equal to 9. Now there is no number in the tens place. So our answer is 9. There are 9 biscuits left in the packet. It's almost night and Zoe has to go back to his house. Gaffy has one last question to solve. Children, can you solve this last question of Gaffy? There are 16 questions in a paper. Chiku solved 8 questions. How many questions does Chiku have to solve now? Find the answer to this question and share it with your friends and family. Children, in this video, we learned to do subtraction with borrowing till 20. 